Like no bullshit. But all right, so I got a question, right? Can you date a woman that don't have friends? That has like no friends at all? Like you are friends. <sighs> it's annoying. I can't. I've done it. <laughs> I've done it too. That's why I asked. And this shit's whack. It's I don't just, know. So all right. So Michael, I mean it, it leads it, me to a bigger question of why don't you have any friends? Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. So it's a lot of questions, right? Yeah, yeah. Like so Nobody it's like, like you? no, yeah, like no, you, you don't hang out with yeah, your cousins. Only one. Yeah, you don't hang out with your cousins. No family. But that's no. the thing. So it's like, nobody? I don't know if you could trust somebody that nobody trusts. That nobody trusts. Yeah, like why? You got to ask that question though. Like, why don't you have any friends? Because I, I, I look at it like this: if you have no friends, then I look at the common denominator. Like, all your friends ain't snakes. Yeah. <laughs> you know, or, or, right, so Pete, so Pete. All right, so let's let's switch it, right? Because I'm talking about a personal situation. It ain't even just about having, like... It's not... I ain't going to say no friends, but yeah. you got friends. Yeah, even, yeah. But you, you don't hang friends. with them. Yeah. Though, like... Like, yeah, I'll, I'll... Like, if they having a cookout, we'll go. But on the... How we hang. Like... Yeah, ain't we, no girls night. If, ain't if the no... Bat, if the bats in to go out, like, hey, look, we going to happy hour tonight. Bet. Yeah, like, we all going. Yeah. She don't get those type of text messages. Oh, yeah. It's like, yo, you got friends... Cause I see you got yeah, exactly. friends <laughs> with the friends, but yeah, but you just don't be with them. But every time I tell you, look, me, and my, me, and my niggas about to go out real quick. Oh, I right, well, can I come? No, no. <laughs> yeah, no, no me and not. my niggas. Yeah. But the crazy part right. is, you're my girl. Like, this is <laughs> that this, shit is separate. This is also for women too, for that women that's dealing with this type of shit. When a nigga say no, niggas, nigga, the nigga you fucking with wants you to come because he don't give a fuck. He don't want you to come because it makes other niggas like feel out of place yeah. because they can't talk nigga talk. Yeah. yeah. Because they, they then they turn to, oh, you hang with them. No. Yeah. Like yep. you can't if I fuck with a nigga that's in a relationship that's cheating, right? I, I may not agree the fact that he's cheating, but he talks but about what, it. Yeah, that's what he does. And yeah. then he talks about it in front of you. You're going to say, oh, you can't hang with him no more because yeah. he likes cheating on bitches. I actually gave a shorty. I wouldn't give my passcode to a shorty for that very reason. It was like, it ain't because of what I'm hiding, but I have conversations with my yeah. homeboys that you just don't need to see. Yeah. Well, I got married. And it ain't, got, yeah, shit like, and it ain't like, got shit to do with you. It ain't got shit to do with you. I, and then you going, we might be somewhere where... The nigga gonna be with his girl. girl. Yeah, like, now you yeah. looking at them sideways like, oh, this like, nigga cheating on this bitch. bitch. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, no. So it's, I and then put... female, they they like to do little fucking sideline vindictive shit. They might pull the nigga girl to the side like, hey, girl, let me tell you what your nigga like. And now I got an argument with my nigga like, yo, bro, your girl yeah. went to my girl on some wild shit. It's like, bro, I don't know what the fuck yeah. you talking about. Now I'm pillow talking. It's happened to me. Yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's happened to me. <laughs> So yeah, I mean that shit just it, it causes it's a motherfucking ripple yeah. effect, bro. So you ever walk out your house and get in the car to a, a wild ass statement like you got this bitch pregnant? <laughs> that wasn't the exact statement, but because I about to say, boy, you different. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't the exact hey. statement. <laughs> hey, I'd, I'd have been in some wild situations. Jesus, that was Christ. the exact statement. <laughs> I know that. Was I'm this. not. Yeah, I'm not that gonna lie to y'all. That it shit happened. was too particular like. to not be. <laughs> That shit was too particular to not be an exact statement. All right, so I got, I, I, got, a, I, got a, I got a better question, like, coming off of that question. How does it go when you break up with your shorty with your friends? What do you mean? You know if what you, the fuck he mean. If you walk in the house <laughs> and see your shorty there, your ex-girl there. My like my ex girl, not just the bitch that I was fucking. Yes, bitch. When you walk in HQ, you see your you ex got, there chilling. You know What's exactly up? what the fuck niggas is catching hands. The fuck wrong with y'all? Like an ex well, that I, I ain't love. Caught y'all niggas yet? <laughs> I ain't been in. I ain't been in the crib with you. <laughs> oh you? Oh he's been there. <laughs> and he seen my face like what the fuck again? <laughs> that was on some chilling shit though. That's what he's trying to oh, say. Oh, all right. Like, like, yeah, no, yo, no. Oh, I thought no, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I thought you yeah, like niggas are shooting their shots. No, no, oh, no. Not going that way. Oh, yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I was in a whole different wave. You, oh, When well, you break up with your shorty and then you walk in, in your people's crib, you think you're safe haven. <laughs> All right, I got you. It's like what the fuck? <laughs> and it's probably that's my. Like, it's probably worse when you in an argument with your girl and you go to the queue yeah, and like, then your ex, yeah. like she over there. Chill. Oh yeah. no, my girl hate the queue. Yeah, I no, no I'm talking about. She know when I come back for the queue, I'm no, coming back done. irregular. No, what I'm saying is every like, look, every <laughs> my ex hated when I yeah. I'm going to country house. God damn it. No, what I meant was like you get in an argument with your girl and then you go to the I'm queue out. and then. <laughs> 
the old joint, the me. old joint is over there now. So yeah, you like, a, damn. I see what you said, but it's it's mutual friends involved. All right, so Pete, right? Because to me, like at, at some point, it was like, all right, yo, when I break up, y'all break up. Y'all break up. <laughs> <laughs> no, because I can't, I can't move forward because like, I feel you know, it is life odd. Is, like even it's, it gets deeper than that. Like even when you consider family, right? You go to your aunt crib, right? You bringing your girl mm-hmm. to your aunt crib, yeah. But your ex is there. Yeah, yeah, that's that's yeah. yeah. I see how it's, it makes it hard to move on from life. So I feel you. Yeah. Like I, can't, I, I've never had to deal with that, so I, I don't. If I bring if I bring my shorty to the queue, it's a, it's a possibility. Yeah, I see that. You know what I'm saying? Then it's awkward. It's awkward. Yeah. Like I'm a, I'm gonna still move like I move, but shorty know who shorty is. Yeah. And she gonna be like, oh hell no, like. And How it, often do she? Yeah, like. And then, then it's gonna be on some. Oh, so every time you come over here, she over here. So, no. So I guess the real question that we're asking is, like, when you break up with with somebody, are your friends supposed to break up with them too? I play like that. For the, I no, I, I play like that to the fact of being around you. Now, if like one of my niggas, like my niggas, niggas, like girl, text me because at that point, like, she my sister. Like yeah. once you start fucking with my nigga, yeah, that's my brother. Way. You my sister, and that's how we gonna keep that shit. So if you if you text me on some shit like, yo, what's popping tonight? Type shit. Cool, I can I can respond to that. But it's been situations where I've been in where I've known my nigga and shorty girl fucking with each other, and I'm having something at my crib. He texts me on some. Yo, is Shorty gonna be there? And I'm like, I think she is coming. He was like, All right, I'll see you next time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then, it ain't even, it, but it made me it mad. It. it made me mad because I'm like, nigga, I wanted to see you more than I wanted to see yeah, her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> I can tell her the shit canceled. <laughs> or like No bullshit. Whatever the case. That's what there. I told him. I was like, bro, I tell her she can't come. Yeah. All off the rip. Like, cause I don't, you know, I don't hold no goddamn punches. Like, yeah. no, nah, bitch, like. He gonna be here, and I don't want you here because y'all may get to arguing in my house. Yeah, and I ain't playing that shit tonight. Yeah, and then she can she gonna kick back on some. No, I swear to God, everything gonna be cool. Yeah. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. The decision has been made. They always say that because I mean, even if they know anytime, anytime you tell you it's gonna be cool, it's not. It's gonna not be cool. gonna be cool. It's not gonna be cool. <laughs> so, so that's like somebody saying, "Yo, let my hands go. I ain't gonna hit you." <laughs> let me yeah. up. Let me just let me up. I'll Give me my alone. gun back. I promise. I'll I will. Yeah, I'm not gonna shoot him. <laughs> I'm not gonna shoot him. Just Dumb as hell. <laughs> nah, but like, so what do y'all think though? Because y'all didn't answer the question. Because <laughs> I don't know how to. Like I said, I've never had to deal with that, so I, it's hard for me to. Uh, All right, so Pete, right? I get it's an awkward situation. If if you bring your shorty to the queue, right? Because yeah. that's where I went wrong. I brought my ex to the queue. She got cool. Everybody liked her, which was cool because mm-hmm. I want everybody to like her. Yeah. I bring around my aunts and shit. Everybody like her. This, that, and the other. Bring around the unks. Everybody like her. But then it's like, I right, yo, we're not together no more. I want to go to my uncle's house. Without you, Without seeing you. You being there. <laughs> like, <laughs> family ties I would definitely cut off. Yeah, that's yeah, a Family fact. ties got to go. Like, I'm you, not, you can't be around my family yeah. more now that we broke up than yeah. you was around them when we was together. Like, and yeah, I be I thinking can't. that I be thinking if we're not together, bullshit, stop going around my family. Yeah. I be thinking and I'm gonna tell my family, stop calling her, yo. <laughs> they work on both like, ends. You like, stop going around them, y'all stop calling her. <laughs> like, What's wrong with y'all? Yeah, you want to <laughs> yeah. yeah, talk? You Facetime her, or you be her Facebook friend or some shit? That's like, what you I don't say. Have it's to, cool. Yeah. It's cool if you want to text, like check up, yeah, yeah, and have a conversation. But pulling up, yeah. like come on, cuz like yeah. you know where I'm at every Sunday, like. So yeah, family, yeah, family definitely got to stop with me. Um Friends a little, I guess that'd be a little more difficult because you build relationships with friends too. Like yeah, and then, I mean, you know, because friends, that- is, friends is friends, so it's like. All right, cool, but is that friend the friend for the right reasons? Now, see, I could, I could. Because that's, on that's her a end, question. That's a on, question on her could. end, it might be you my friend because I'm just trying to be petty. A good possibility. The nigga, the nigga ain't thinking it like that. He like, fuck it. Yeah, she just cool. Like, you know yeah, I mean? fuck it. She, she said she, she bring a home girl and she bring, so often, and she bringing bitches over. Yeah, so yeah, I'm. I got a possibility to hit one of her bitches. Yeah, you know what I'm yes. saying. It's, so it's enticing. <laughs> it's enticing. You know, what you got. I mean, you got to judge that based off of the, the, particular, the situation. Yeah, yeah. based but off the nah, so woman. Me personally, like, kind of like you said, like I kind of, I kind of draw the line. Like, I, right, I know bro gonna be here. This shit awkward, bro. 
I grew up with, bro. So I let her know, like, yeah, not tonight. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? But then does it it even get weird to the fact of, like, if your ex is at my crib chilling, like, and you just happen to send a drunk text. Like, where you at? I'm at Giovanni's house. Fuck you doing there? (laughs) (laughs) It's just (laughs) y'all? Cause I know what I know what he about. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck? I gotta fight every yeah. night to prove God my look. Damn. You said he made you stuffed chicken. <laughs> you over here, the nigga just cooking for you? Oh. Bet this, this nigga don't even like the no, cup. No, you, no, you like, <laughs> no, she fucking this nigga. It ain't, it ain't oodles and noodles. Patron. You gotta convince yourself not to be mad at your homeboy. Like, I mean, I can't blame that. Patron, nigga. This, nigga, that nigga would do. this nigga only brings Jose to the pull up. He's <laughs> Patron. <laughs> Hey, he's a funny nigga. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know niggas got that yeah, he's, uh, he's just doing what niggas would do. I, I do the same shit. <laughs> Yo, that's where niggas go wrong at though. Niggas always go wrong with a like sincerely forgiving their friend when they do some fuck yeah. shit. Yeah. Just because you say, man, he just being a he's nigga. A no. Nigga. <laughs> Yo, that's, that's like that's address, bad. You gotta address the shit, nigga. You gotta talk about it. Like no, that's like at the, the least talk about that's it. That's like <laughs> the phrase your nigga fuck your bitch. This your nigga. And yo, y'all did you a favor. Like, how the fuck was that doing me a favor? Nigga? I showed you that she's a cheater. <laughs> Bitch. You should have just me told me, you, nigga. Like, if you don't come outside to this grass. <laughs> yeah. what the Wait, fuck, you bro? still my bro after this, but we got to catch his ass. No, we got to catch this face. This and play. you can win. I don't yeah, but the fade got to go. But I got to put go. some kind of hands on you. I, I'm, no, I'm, Bitch, throwing I can lose. I'm throwing the first punch. I know. <laughs> He's not making it off the stairs. <laughs> you think we going to the grass, bitch? We going to this balcony. That's it. <laughs> and I'm walking out the door first. As soon as you turn around, out that right. door. Pop! Let's get it. <laughs> Fuck wrong with you. But God. you brought up a you brought up a good point. You said that women be women can be conniving. So how do you know if she's doing it for the right reasons? I want to know how women handle those situations. Because they slick yeah. as shit. No, I don't So women don't have all the niggas in the crib and just be lying for a homegirl like this, my this no. bro, this my bro. Like and her homegirl fucking all of them. Women, yeah. women. What, what women Pam different. say uh, two episodes ago? She's had kickbacks at her crib with, with multiple. She said this on camera. She, yeah. she had one nigga that she was fucking, another nigga that wanted to fuck her, and then she had another nigga that, that she, she was used trying to, to get yeah. to know. Or, yeah, no. So it's like, no. Nah, but I mean, honestly, women move differently to us because we. Yeah, we be in there sweating bullets. Yeah, I was about to say we be there sweating bullets because we know that's some shit problem. about to go wrong. <laughs> And we also know the 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 status of women. Yeah. They know they, yeah. everything. Yeah, like they didn't went on your Instagram, went to your followers, all your comments. Out, they didn't figure out who the fuck you That's fucking. A fact. They read the comments, nigga. <laughs> like, bro, <laughs> they figured out who you fucking right. So when you there, she walk in. It's like, yeah, I love you, girl. What the fuck wrong with you? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Chill out. Nah, just bitching your comments all the time. <laughs> But, Ain't nothing worse than getting a screenshot of, of, of a comment somebody said to you like, bitch, I can't control what she said. Y'all yeah. know I say some wild shit on Facebook. Nigga, ain't nothing worse than getting a text from your girl <laughs> when you don't expect a text from your girl. <laughs> <laughs> we need to When talk. she texts you first. <laughs> we need yo, to nah, talk. Yo, no, that we need to talk text, that shit is wild. Hey, you don't, say, don't send me no we need to talk text. I don't, don't give a, no, I don't give I, a fuck I call if she want to talk about Immediately. Me. I call immediately. We can talk now. Right now. I'm free. I'm good. Do I just... Cause I may not come over there. Yeah. <laughs> so we need. No, you know how go. Was, you know how it's about to be some wild shit when they tell you, oh, it can wait till later. No, it can't. Bitch, what you mean? It so why didn't you wait till later to tell me that we need? You to talk? won't see me till you're asleep. <laughs> 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 Bitch, I'm coming in the house at four a.m. <laughs> I already deal with that argument. <laughs> Dude, what the? F- you better forget what the fuck talk. you thought. <laughs> <laughs> we need to talk. Why the fuck you coming in info? Check my no. snap. I was at the queue. No bitch. I won't do nothing wild. Check my snaps. <laughs> Country sent you a picture of me sleep, sleep on his on couch. The couch. <laughs> Check the snaps. I was with timestamps. <laughs> the clock is in the background. Yeah, but I don't even care. If she want to talk about planning a vacation. Just say that. Don't it's tell not... me we need to talk because my mind. I'm already a pessimist I anyway. Up. No, my <laughs> I'm mind a pessimistic is... nigga. So I automatically think some shit wrong when they say we need to talk. When I hear we need to talk, my first thought is no bitch. You need to talk and you want me to listen because I don't have shit to say. <laughs> I'm Look, cool. So this is what we got to start asking. You want advice or you want to vent? <laughs> like, what do you, what do you, you want to talk about? You want advice nah, or do no you want bullshit, to vent? No bullshit, though. Like, when you get to... Here's how you fuck them up. Be like, yeah, I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> Hit him with that shit. That's a yeah. bar. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> so what you... But what then you, then you, you fucked she, up. But she gonna ask. You fucked so up. So what ask, you want to talk about? Well, you, you started this. Bitch, so you, you started this. So the fuck? I'll let you get it off your chest first. <laughs> 
I don't got nothing to talk about. Cause, cause mine could have waited. But look, yeah. but, but but in the midst of her Cause telling you, waited. your mind, your mind started thinking of some shit. It buys no, some time. But, but outside of that, the best feeling is when you figure out it ain't really no bullshit. Like, hey, I was just wondering, do you really like your chicken fried like that? <laughs> Bitch, you could have touched me that t- shit. You had me a country out drinking shots. I'm know, nervous as fuck. Just wanted to know if you, you wanted to go out Saturday start, night. I, I think I we know should start chick meal flip, prepping. Like, I, that's all. I thought we should start meal prepping. What do you think? So what did you want to talk about? It ain't even important. Yeah, <laughs> we straight, yo. <laughs> same thing. I thought the same shit. We should start meal prepping, baby. <laughs> I was actually in the restaurant depot. Yeah. And yeah. I seen these fucking boxes that it can do that shit. Yeah, that you fuck them up. Like, you know what? It's crazy because I was just about to ask you if we, we should buy an air fryer. <laughs> <laughs> I just said, everybody talk about the air fryers and shit. You talking about meal prepping. Niggas got to stop getting nervous. That's when we fuck up. You be nervous, you don't know how to react. Nigga, you be scared to walk in the threshold of the door. No, you, you know how wild that sounds? Is you scared to go to, into your own fucking house? <laughs> like, this is what we deal the with house as men. The that you pay the mortgage like, yeah. on this shit. But you know the crazy this shit. This is the shit we deal with as men that don't nobody ever address. No, I'm going to tell you the crazy shit about how our, our brains work as men. We'll go to war with a group of niggas. With no problem. Shootouts in the parking lot. Niggas been there. Fights in the club. <laughs> My girl takes me. We girl need to talk. Me. I'm not coming your heart home. drops. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, yeah. y'all niggas, we're going to have a shootout. I might need to die tonight. Yeah. I, you, know, not, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? I'd rather niggas be, in, be ready to ride for that niggas pulling the grips out and all that shit. Rather be in jail than go home and tell them we need to talk. <laughs> no, nah, I'm just going to go and get locked up tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I had, I wore this white for some reason. Go and get locked up tonight, B. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> niggas swerving on purpose. Bro. Sober as Somebody as pull me over. Yeah. <laughs> Nigga, sober as hell. Just so you can go home mad in the morning, slamming door and shit. Hey, that's funny though. I see. Had a rough night. Hate these, these fucking white ass motherfucking police. Always oh, fucking with me. I gotta see if I can find it. It was a link. Dude actually had the cop send a video to his girl. Like I got pulled over. That's why I'm late. The cop was like, Yeah, he got pulled over. Like I'm writing the ticket now. <laughs> that's just wild. That shit, the niggas have to prove to their girls. But girls will never understand what men go through being with Yo, them. Yeah, no, that's you like know what the scary shit is when you tell your girl the truth. And she don't believe it? No. What are you supposed to do, bitch? No. Like, like no, the, I worst shit, the worst shit is when the truth sounds like pure it's bullshit. It's that bullshit, yeah. <laughs> but it's not. I swear to God, it's the truth, dog. <laughs> no. Arguing I, the truth. The deer, bro. I really did see the deer, bro, bitch. Like, there's a deer, bro. Arguing the truth is one of the hardest things you possibly could do because, but it also goes down to who's arguing the truth. Because most of us are scumbags. So <laughs> I'm an ex scumbag. I'm no longer. Yeah, I'm no longer either. Yeah, yeah. We retired. But, I'm scumbags. wholesome like a motherfucker. But, all right, so Pete, right? Like my girl, she knew I was an ex scumbag. She knew I used to be a hoe. I was out here doing whatever, boom, boom. So when she asked the question, where the fuck you been? <laughs> Man, listen, I fell asleep at Country House. This shit is not adding up immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Like no, <laughs> like off the rip. It's like no, nigga. Sound like some bullshit. I called country already, and he told me you won't there. But shout out my nigga country because I got good friends. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> gotta have good friends. You gotta have. That's another question. Who is your real friend? You know you do know. some scumbag shit. <laughs> But but no, like before they don't even know you doing scumbag shit. But they get the call, like, yo, where where'd Giovanni at? Shit, I ain't told that nigga. You know. I just woke up. <laughs> yeah. like, it's nine PM, you just woke up. Yes, I just woke up. I'm out of I'm out of the Matter beach. of fact, he, I'm gonna call you right back. Let me call yeah. him and see if he pick up for me. Is he on he, hey, look, hey bro? Yeah. Bro, your girl calling me. Girl calling, man. Wake the fuck kicking you and shit. Wake the fuck up. <laughs> Niggas really used to get caught up lying, but not telling their friends though. You gotta tell your friends if you're gonna lie and fall them. Hey, country would take that thing. shit to a thousand too. I think she on the way over here. Country would, <laughs> country would never do no shit like that. <laughs> no, nah, but I've, I've did like that with my like girl. That I my friends don't. Lie. Yeah, no, nah, country yeah. don't do shit. Like, my friend, yeah, my whole, friends don't lie. He's a wholesome anymore. guy. Country yeah. tells the truth. He like, don't, about we speaking truth. hypothetically. We all shit. we all grew up at the same day, on the same day. We said, "Fuck it, we gonna stop being scumbags," and we stopped that day. We did. It was yeah. probably two years ago. However, <laughs> if you are dealing with an ex scumbag, ladies, and he happens to slip and relapse and do some scumbag shit, forgive him. <laughs> he really loves you. It happens. That's a fact. 
If you dealing with somebody, like, who, I'm, if you dealing with somebody who used to do drugs and they slip and they relapse, are you gonna leave them because they had a relapse? No, I think you gonna look the fucking drug. No, you gonna love them in nurse. You already know what drug they was on though, so you gonna love them in nurse, motherfucker. You knew they was on crack before, motherfucker. He ain't just missing a two. Yeah, you shouldn't have. Shouldn't have been there from the beginning, bitch. All right, they ain't, they <laughs> no, ain't dog but food. on we some good. real nigga shit, okay. you gotta forget and on nurse some real back nigga to shit, health. Like, like what you said though. Like outside of that, like ladies, y'all need to know what y'all end all be all is. Like, don't don't go through my phone, see a text message, and then be like, "All right, I'm done with you." If that's not really worth breaking this relationship up, depending on if your relationship is really good, yeah. Like, shit gotta be solid. I bet, like. I know I fucked up. Now, if he just keep doing it, that's that's on you to leave. But at the yeah, same time, uh, it's like, damn, I'm burping like a motherfucker. Ladies, if you find a nigga and the first time you go through his phone, you see him entertaining some shit. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta let one go, my nigga. You got to. Yeah. It ain't had a conversation. Bring it up. Yeah. It ain't nothing wrong with bringing it up. Address the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? No, address it and let him know. Like I ain't dealing with this shit. Yeah. Then once you tell them you ain't dealing with it, that's your warning. That's like, it. Let's move forward. Everybody, everybody makes mistakes. I'm tired of people saying that their end all be all is cheating because not everybody's end all be all is cheating. Yo. It's I've not done, that. I've it's done the research. Statistically, they say more people. They say like 67 percent of people say that they're gonna leave after somebody cheats, but the percentage of people that leave is like 30. No, the crazy it's, shit. More people get left over finances than cheating. Yeah. I I don't think people understand when they say cheating. That's a vague fucking statement. Cheating is what your definition definition is of cheating. That's true. Women yeah, think some women, women think texting is cheating. Yeah, I was about yeah. that was literally what, you know what I was saying? about to say. Like women think because a girl texts me a goddamn butt naked picture that I didn't even ask for is cheating. I didn't ask for that shit, yeah. but I looked at it, so I'm cheating. I'm going. No. With yeah, I like, thought I was gonna put my tongue in her ass. I was just bored at work though. Yeah. Shooting shit. That was Cal that said that. <laughs> Dang, I just want to let it be known, baby. I love you. I'm single. I can do what the fuck I, I want to do. I'm not. I live with my girl. Mm. It's, it's amazing. amazing it's situation. amazing. It's amazing. I know. Mm. That nigga Javon is like, I got to live here. You don't. <laughs> oh, I didn't say that before. <laughs> you got to tell niggas. No, you I had to tell niggas from out of town. Yeah. Bitch, you ain't from here. Yeah. Like nah, nigga, you're not about to get you me about to up. get on the plane and go home. <laughs> to I a got peaceful a, situation. Yeah. No, nah, nah, you're not about to have my you shit. You ain't about to up. fuck this shit up. No, <laughs> Hell no. That's These what bills got to get paid. That's growth. <laughs> it's growth, B. Um, you know what you got? Here's what niggas really need to do. Like once you really solid with your shorty, you got to really sit down and let her know what type of scumbag you used to be, so she can compare it to the man you are now. All right, so peep, I can tell you a story because <laughs> it's a true story. I thought Shorty went through my phone and she didn't. My drunk ass showed her every text message of bitches <laughs> saying, I want to fuck you, this and that. I was like, you see what I'm giving up for you? <laughs> it's, it's, it's a harsh reality. No, it's a harsh reality, but it was a rough house. <laughs> <laughs> my dumb ass. You probably should have did it that way. <laughs> but did it work? But I was drunk as fuck. But did it work? Hell no, because I. <laughs> hell no. <laughs> Nothing works when it comes to women. Lesson be learned. <laughs> Stop telling women the truth, B. Nah, I got to wrap Tyree up. still got the bar of the decade. Who was it? Drop it on us. I lie to you because I love Cause you. Because I love you. Yeah. I tell the truth to these other bitches because I don't, don't give, give a, a fuck. fuck about him. <laughs> he had the bar it of was. the decade. Women hated for, it. For when we were scared. Every nigga <laughs> resonated with it. It was like, God damn, that's the truth. <laughs> It's the truth. The baby yeah. boy came out when we was young. Yeah, and we was all hoes then. When baby boy <laughs> dropped, it was that's like big hoes. <laughs> like, I'm out man. here getting these numbers up. Nigga. Jody was like motherfucking Iron Man and niggas <laughs> back, in, back in them days. So we got a lot of questions for y'all to answer. I need to wrap this up. No, nah, we ain't wrapping shit up before I before I go. 